In this video, I'm going to demonstrate you the correct way to insert oropharyngeal airway. In this video, you can see there is flange, body, tip and airway channel. These are the parts of oropharyngeal airway. Now what are the indications? These are airway maintenance in unconscious patients protects an endotracheal tube from being bitten, facilitates airway suctioning. Now this is an oropharyngeal airway. First is the size estimation. Flange at mid incisors and tip at angle of the jaw. This is the way how we measure the correct size. When this is the wrong technique I am showing right now, this is the wrong technique, we don't have to keep concave downwards. Concave side of oropharyngeal airway has to face towards the hard palate. So, concave side of airway facing towards the hard palate, gently insert and once halfway down, rotate the airway 180 degree and then advance further until the distal end lies in the oropharynx. This is the correct way to put oropharyngeal airway complications, airway obstruction, aspiration and injury. 